on that side. Yeah. He's only high points. Right, good morning. Welcome to this special video here on Coaster Crazy. Uh, as you can see from the title and from the queue line that we're walking down at the minute, it's actually the opening day for the Haunted House Monster Party. Unfortunately, I couldn't get like a preview event or anything like that, but there's an actual public one that's about to happen now. We've got to get some fireworks and uh, pyrotechnics and a little show. So we've all walked down here. There's the uh, front of it already. There's Alex Ooh, as well. Oh, spooky. Hi, Colin. And, and Nick, you are right, Nick? Hello, Andy. We're We're joined by Connor, my mate Connor. Uh, we're actually going to a couple of fun fairs later, aren't we? Yeah, it's going to be good. And then you got Sorry. Nikki and Chris as well. Oh, right. They're quite regulars on other channels, you're right, mate? There's quite a lot of people here. They're on the telly, yeah, they are. He's on the telly. So, yeah, very excited to get on this. It's a Vacoma Madhouse, very similar to Hex at Alton Towers and the Haunton at Drayton Manor. The facade looks amazing for this. <laughs> it looks great. Um, obviously, the back side of it as well, you'll see it as we walk through the queue line. It's, a, it's just basically a, back, a black shed. Doesn't look great. Um, there is a story behind that. Oh, is there? Oh. So, the subplot is that the owner of this mansion ripped out the back of his house and built a ah. shed to install this is crazy it, invention. Is this a bit of a spoiler, Nick? Well, <laughs> it explains tin shed in the back. Right, okay. Oh, excellent. So there you go. So there's a bit of a backstory to it. You've got all these little figures up here. There's a big, nice sign. Not too keen on the big cattle pen queue line, but we are at Legoland at the end of the day. And it is the UK's busiest theme park. I mean, it's absolutely rammed today. We come in pretty much, um, well, I think it was about half ten we got here and it was busy already, wasn't it, yeah, Connor? Yeah, really Absol busy. Really yeah, we busy. just had one ride on um, Atlantis. the Atlantis. That was on ten minutes. So, I've got to be quiet. There's a, it's going to be a bit of a talk. We've got the team tit um, titanium fireworks down there. But the faca facade looks amazing. These these guys have already been on it. Shows your passes. There you go. Get your pass, <laughs> Get your pass out. That's what happens when you're famous. You get your VIP guest pass. I'm famous. I know. I don't. The telly, aren't you? I know. I don't get things like that. Oh, you do. <laughs> so yeah, apparently we can't film on the ride, which is understandable. You're not meant to be filming on rides at Merlin Parks anyway. Uh, but I've been told by these guys here we can film the preview. Uh, maybe get a picture on inside as well. If you haven't already liked my uh, Instagram, which is Coaster Crazy Andy, follow the uh, Coaster Crazy Facebook page as well. I'll post some pictures on there anyway. So yeah, we'll wait until the um, the actual event starts and I'll film that as well. Come on, there's like a thousand of you. I said, who's excited? Yeah! And who is scared? You are. Oh, terrified. Terrified. <laughs> <laughs> now, before the rides open, so we will be having a little celebration. There'll be some dancing, there will be some special effects. So, dads, I expect to see that dad dancing at its finest this afternoon. And the festivities will kick off in just over 10 minutes. Ooh. Bit earlier than the planned, then. Yeah, we actually we waited at the, uh, the at the barriers up at the top. We waited for about what? Probably about half an hour, 40 yeah, minutes or something. Right. They did say they were opening the barriers at 12. It's 10 to 12 now, and then this ceremony wasn't going to start until half 12. So because everyone's here, I think they've just pushed it forward a bit just to get everyone in here because there's a lot of people here, and obviously for health and safety reasons, um, they don't want a big crush of people down here. But uh, I hope it's a good ride. Like I said, this is the first actual, first ever getting on a ride I've ever done like this before. I've never been to a ride preview before, and uh, which is pretty good actually. First time. Fill your walls and please welcome to the stage Park Operations Director, Mr. Chris Ireland. Good afternoon, girls and boys! Good Ladies afternoon. and gentlemen! 
My name is Chris Island and I am Park Operations Director and it is my absolute pleasure to welcome you all to Legoland Windsor Resort and to the official launch and opening of our awesome new ride, Haunted House Monster Party! Yay! Is everybody excited? Yeah! I'm excited! Is everybody you. excited? Yes. Are you? Are you? Are you? These guys are. Are you guys excited? Yeah. Are you? I'm excited. Yeah. I reckon you guys were louder. Are you guys excited? Yeah. Super excited. Now, inside, the banquet table is set. Okay, all of our decorations are hung up, but we need some special guests to help us open and to have a proper party here today, don't we? Yeah. Yes, we do. Okay, so flying in from all around the world, we have some very special visitors. And I would like you all to help me welcome to the stage our first visitors flying in all the way from Legoland California Resort is Scarecrow and Witch. Make some noise for Just to let you know, guys, if you can see anything on this screen, I actually can't see anything at all. This is, this is, this, yeah, this is my view. Hi <laughs> on, Nick. Would happen. It's a bit of a crush. There's so many people pushing to get in. Come on, let's go. Now we're here. <laughs> I can see you now. You're right, Alex. I'm not on the telly now, am I? Uh... What did you think of that, Andy? That yeah. Was good. That was alright, that. Where's me, mate? They're coming. They're alright. They're on the way. Well, we've got to walk around this uh, cute cattle pen queue line now. We're going to for this ride now, yeah. probably. If the Blazer Raid is anything to base your queue off. It's not actually that bad for the people down the back here. It's just and it's a, a madhouse and they have good throughput. Yeah. Who's, who have we lost? It's Chris, Chris and, and Nicky. Right, so have a look around here. We've got this wooden, sorry, uh, rubber flooring's really nice. You can smell the rubber. <laughs> well, 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 I know, we'll wait for like you. I know. It was a bit of a crush. Look at this. Look at this queue line, this is crazy. It's a zoo, but we're in the enclosure. <laughs> yeah. You got these posters around Where everywhere. <laughs> Walking to the graveyard, here we go. Yeah, there they are. <laughs> da, da, da. Hey, he's on the telly. <laughs> With Mike Jevons. So the, uh, the ride's over there, we're now ended up walking around back over that way now. <laughs> Very, very nice. Pyro, yeah, 
Yeah, it was good, oh, that, wasn't it? I thought that'll test the durability of this bunting in the queue line, wouldn't it? <laughs> Right, half an hour later. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Couple... I know, this is mental. Look at it now. Yeah, I think we definitely queued on the right side anyway. laser raiders now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the queue times today. Have you? Yeah. Is it really? I haven't checked my watch. But yeah, probably walked quite a distance already. Yeah, some of the queue times today are, are ridiculous. And I know I say it quite often in my vlogs, get yourselves to these smaller parks. Paltons Park is an amazing family park. There's all these thousands of people here today. Go to, uh, go to Poland. Uh, Paltons Park's amazing. So I was just saying before, apparently there's a backstory to why half the building's not finished. So following the staff down to the entrance. It's a great time for laser raiders, what I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, true. Ah, uh, look at this, that's quite cool with the little wolf in there. We're getting closer. Yeah, this is pretty amazing for me actually, like I was just saying before, this is actually the first time I've ever been to a park and gotten a ride for like opening day really. You have to wait for me, mate. Connor is over there. You got these little twirly things, things to do in the uh, queue line while you're waiting. Some nice bit of theming and stuff down here. It's nice to be at an opening ceremony for. I think it's yeah, a good one. it's great. Like again, I mentioned the floor's all like this rubber, rubber stuff. So is that a boogie? Boogie woogie. <laughs> Yeah, the facade for this does look really good. I'm liking all the nice little planting they've got down here. They'll actually close the gate. I think there's a, I think there's a two, two queue line for it. There's a, there's a queue bot entrance, but that's not, not open yet. Something like that, yeah. yeah so let's get on it. It's gonna be a good ride. Vlog on it. Yeah, vlog on vlog. Uh, yeah, his channel. It's uh, I'm rubbish. Painful vlogs. Painful vlogs. P a y n e. Yeah. Check me out. Yeah, check him out. Yeah, looking forward to this. We'll be like some of the first people to get on it. You've already been on it, so you know, what what did you think then? <laughs> it's really, really sweet. What was that? You've been on it since four? Yeah, it's been open since 8.30. 8.30? Are you serious? We didn't yeah. even know about that. We've done two rides on it today, haven't we? Yeah. Two rides. So go on then, what did you think, Nick? It's really, really cute for Legoland. Yeah. It's, um, <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's exactly what this park is. Yeah, it's definitely. The target market. It's really forceful. Though. Is it really? And it, it's so smooth in its transitions. Oh, excellent. And it's just a really, really Transition, good it's not a coaster, Nick. I know, but it's <laughs> the way so it moves, it's lovely. Or is it? Oh, oh, the launch oh, segment's incredible. Oh, is yeah, it? Yeah. Better than Taron? Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> better than Troy, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, it's not. Not better than <laughs> <laughs> Right, I think the doors have just opened up. Like I said, no filming on the ride, unfortunately. It's quite understandable, but I'll try and get a picture as we walk into the room as well. I'll post it onto the uh, Facebook page, Coaster Crazy, check me out. You know, why not? Let's go. I think we can film the uh, pre-show. Yeah. Here we go. First public people to ride this new Vekoma Madhouse at Legoland in Windsor. Looks very nice. There's a lot of people waiting. Busy week. Yeah. That's a new ride smell. Oh, it smells great, that. That smells lovely. Very nice. What was up? Wheelchair access. What? Well, oh, well, sorry. It's Nicole Perkins. <laughs> Is that your butler? Yeah. It's Nick's butler. Great to have heard it. I just passed today. 
creep upstairs into the grand foyer. The party won't start without you. Smell bog spotted. There it is. Up there. Oh yeah. Can't miss it. Yeah, it smells lovely inside here. It smells really yeah. good. Look at this. Whoa. I think there'd be a lot of kids quite scared or something like this, yeah. Tears on the first one. This is what it's all about. Tears on the first public ride. These are really good. The theming's really nice. I mean, yes, I'm nearly 40 years old, and I know Sean mentions this quite often as well. We're not really the target market for this park, but I've been into Lego ever since I was a kid, and some of the first Lego sets I ever had was actually the castle sort of stuff. Yeah. Come down this way, come this way. Follow my boys, follow the boys. I can't see nothing. It's dark in here, you got a mirror ball up the top. You've got some screens up here. I can sort of see where Alex has gone. Wow. And it's through these doors. Right, that was it. We've literally just walked off the ride. Uh, we'll give you a full review. Uh, I just want to say, if anyone doesn't want to know any spoilers, I will put some spoilers in here. It's really good, actually. Just as forceful as Hex um, at Alton Towers. The theming's obviously, it's not as good as Hex. Uh, but it's really good inside. The theming's great. You got like this big table. Again, I, t I, t I took a sneaky picture. Um, you can't film on the ride, but there's some really good bits. There's a good soundtrack to it. The um, it's really good. Like this big table in the middle, with, like sweets and cakes and things on it, and um, the smell pods in there. So I like what you said, like bubble gum. Yeah, yeah. it's a really it's a strong. Um, you know when you go to like a confectionery shop, sweet shop, it's yeah. really. It's really, uh, really strong. Well, what did you it's think good. then, as, uh, a, as awesome. a package? Very forceful. It's it a, was. Yeah, <laughs> it's very strong. But yeah, as a, as a complete ride, it's awesome. Yeah, it's I'm, amazing. Uh, I'm, I'm not too sure. I didn't get the... the they, we were told that the back building was themed. It was part of the storyline. Yeah, not too no, sure. I don't know. Yeah, um, yeah I'm Nick... not too sure, but yeah, it's... Uh, it's pretty good. That's pretty much where the um, ride is itself. But no, not a, not a massive long pre-show for it like some of the other yeah yeah a few minutes um the ceiling what did you think of the no, ceiling? ceiling was amazing right? no, like, uh, it's a complete shock yeah me. like you've been on hex before you've got the ceiling it's got the tree on it this one it's got like these UV it's like, a uv paint yeah, isn't it yeah, then yeah, it just yeah. all appears all of a sudden like big stencils. it's brilliant yeah people were clapping on there people yeah. were cheering on there i thought that was a really good ride get yourselves down here like there was no really any spoilers it was just re really what was on the ceiling really um really good addition to the park brilliant to actually come and be one of the i think we were on the first yeah, ride the first one, weren't yeah. we first yeah. public ride of the of the of the well of the new ride really um, obviously they got the preview people that have been on it before us but 
I think we were the first, yeah, first, first public first, ride on that. Yeah. That I'm was really great. Happy with that. That's a great addition for that. It is lot. brilliant. Get yourselves down to Legoland this season and come and ride it. I'll get you some more footage off um, of the front and stuff as we walk out. But we won't be doing any more rides today. It's literally just coming here and checking it out, um, showing you what, what it's all about, really. Obviously, you can't film on the ride, so anyone that does film on the ride or any POVs pop up on YouTube, then obviously they're not allowed to do that. But it is good. It's pretty much like Hex and um, The Haunting at Drayton Manor. A very good, solid ride, actually. Great for the kids. It is a little bit scary, I must admit, but no, very, very, very good. Really impressed with that. Right, so obviously we rode with uh, Nikki and Chris as well, so we get your review, do you want to get a bit closer? What did you think, guys? Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Um, it's got a great soundtrack. <laughs> I think as, as we've all kind of said, everyone was kind of partying away in there. That was nice being on the first sort of public ride. Yeah. Everyone really enjoyed it. And um, yeah, it's really nice sort of pre-show and stuff to it as well. Yeah, I think it's perfect for Legoland. It perfectly it fits the demographic of what you've got. We were sort of talking beforehand about how they've got to try and fuse sort of comedy and scariness and family all at the same time. But I think they've done it really well. So. Yeah, I think it's a good all-round package yeah. really, isn't it? Yeah. It's refreshing to have a mad house there. Hello, got some coming over here now. Yeah, uh, some characters. <laughs> It's a pretty have a madhouse that's not just all out, you know, horror and ghosts and everything, you know, it's been done quite differently. Yeah. Like that, so. Excellent, yeah, brilliant. And I'll ask Nick, what did you think? It, it was really interesting doing it with, without geeks, I mean, with geeks there, but, but with members of the public. And it was a real party in there, people yeah. cheering, clapping, singing along, and um, yeah, it's, like, it's just what Legoland needs, and obviously this... It's a real people eater. Oh, it is now. Look at the queue. That that queue line is completely full now. And uh, it's great because the, the, the park is does get busy, and we need more things to spread the crowds out. And this will do it. It's not scary. It's really fun. Um, but it, 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 it's so, I still can't get my head around how that ride works. Yeah, it's, it's crazy. So bizarre because it sort of sets off, and you think you're upside down yeah. already, but you're not. There's and, quite some force on and it. And there are people there who've never done one before. Yeah. You know, because if you're four years old, you're not going to go to Walton Towers. Exactly. Next, are you? So you're going to be here, and they don't know what's going on. It was amazing. So really, really strong addition to the park. I love it. Excellent. What did you think to the ceiling with the UV paint? Oh, I forgot to ask you guys. It's brilliant. I was quite surprised with that. Nice little touch was that. Yeah, definitely. They got the uh, character dress up here. Hello. Eh? Alex, hello. What did you think? Your I love review? it. I love it. I like. I like an atmosphere, and you know, walking in there. First of all, you know, the queue line. Um, you don't really get too much of a reveal in the queue line, which I quite no. like. It's kind of like the mystery of the ride is kept inside the house, and you know, as you enter the doors, you go in, you're welcomed, you're greeted by the lady on the right hand side, who's actually stood over here right now. She's just, yeah. she's just you know, checking away, <laughs> keeping herself busy. Um, and then you get taken upstairs into kind of the, the pre-show to the banquet. You know, you're getting ready to go and celebrate it. Get you warmed up, get you ready. Let's get that power running, and then you go into the ride, and it's just really feel good. I really I like it. I think the highlight for me is not a massive silly. <laughs> Um, Pre-show at the beginning, no, like it, a lot it, of it, madhouses. It, you don't feel like have, you're waiting around too long. You're not. You don't feel like it's a couple of minutes. Yeah, it, it's exactly what it needs to be. And also, the, the madhouse is really forceful as well. I it is. That. Yeah, just it's as, a very forceful. I madhouse. think it's just as pretty much the same as Hex, really. I think so. Yeah, it was really, really enjoyable. Good fun yeah. um, for families. Absolutely spot on. The soundtrack is stuck in my head. Theme park audio over yeah. there. Really enjoyed it. I, I think Nick's a bit gutted he didn't actually write the music for it. I mean, <laughs> it, it's um, it's a wonderful, wonderful. It's brilliant piece of music. Yeah, it's everywhere. It, yeah, it is outside and everything. Too. Yeah. There's like five or six different versions yeah. of here around the ride. Yeah, fantastic. Really, really good. Right, excellent. Thanks for. Uh, being on Coaster Crazy. Obviously, I'm here as well because someone else couldn't be here today, which he probably wanted to be, but yeah, I'm here for other channels as well. He's here instead. I, I'm just the shadow. <laughs> I just stand in the back and just smile and wave. But it's yeah, it's, I think it's amazing that I've actually come on to a day where it's like the first opening of the year. Uh, of the, of the public people first ride on there as well brilliant I, I really enjoy it get yourselves to Legoland and come and ride Haunted House Monster Party you were, you relied on me <laughs> I, was, I was completely switched off I was just thinking about all the other rides that are in this park and how quiet they're going to be let's get the laser yeah ready. yeah woohoo let's go, let's go. Hi. 
right, there you go. So that was the front of it. Amazing. Do you want to see the line for it now? I don't actually know how long the queue is, but we didn't we didn't queue long at all for it. We're actually going now. This is like a little mini separate video. I've never done anything like this before for the opening day. Um, it's really, really good ride. Get, you've got to come here and you've got to check it out. Like I said, it's pretty much exactly the same as Hex at Alton Towers. Really good ride, quite forceful as well, actually. <laughs> and I really enjoyed the theme. And it's great to come with Connor. Like I said, we're off to a couple of fairs now. So if you are watching this one, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Watch the other vlogs that follow this. This We've got a, a fair in Bedford we're going to, and then we're going to Scarrett's in Northampton. Uh, make sure you check out the other vlogs as well, Flamingo Land and Lightwater Valley, and from the uh, Haunted House Monster Party at Legoland Windsor. I'll see you later. Bye for now.